Hi guys, this is Foreign Free, and today, in my list of favorite apps, I'm going to talk to you about Light Manager. With Light Manager, you can manage which color the LED notification light will give when you have a notification. So, I'll show you the settings of this app real quick. The most important settings are the colors you select for every notification. Here you can see what color I assign to the different apps. You can add any app to the list you want. When you click on the app in the list, you can change the color to your preference. You can even choose a custom color. When you want to test it to see the color, you can simply click on Test. Oh yeah, depending on the device, you have to turn off the screen, of course, in order for the notification light to work. Well, let's do this, and I'll show you what I see. And as soon as I turn my screen back on again, the LED will stop blinking, as you see. Also here, you can change the battery status light, but I pretty much like the default settings with the red and the green of course and there's a lot of other possibilities when you want to use your LED notification light so the last thing to check are the advanced settings a lot of settings here as well a good example of a useful setting is the sleeping time you can select when you don't want the LED LED to blink in my case, I like it when it's on the charger because that's most of the time when it's night and it's on my nightstand. And you can also select here what notification light you do you do want to see during this time. And here, if you have multiple notifications, a light manager will make sure you will see all of the colors blinking and not just the color from the last notification. So when you have a notification that's blue and a notification that's green, you will see a green one and then a blue one and then a green one and then a blue one. Here you can select the interval of change when the notification light will automatically cancel and how smooth the different LED colors change. So here we have some more options and the standard color codes. And there's a way to back up and restore your, all of your preferences. Well, that was pretty much it. Be sure to check out the description below for more info about the app. And check out my other app talk videos. See you guys in the next one. Ciao.